Okay, this month is um, we're doing a fresh catch, and our fresh catch is a swordfish steak. So the swordfish steak uh, is going to be charbroiled, but we're marinating a little bit in a ginger soy, so it's going to have a little bit of an Asian flair to it. But we're also going to put in some wild mushrooms here locally, along with some braised bok choy. Over here I have some uh, ginger soy marinade with some fresh basil and seasonings in it. And then this here will go on the charbroiler. In the meantime, while the swordfish is broiling, then we're gonna do the braised bok choy and wild mushrooms. So I'm gonna start off with a little bit of olive oil. And then I'm gonna take some baby bok choy and I'm gonna pan sear that in there, like so. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna braise that. So while that's sauteing a little bit right now, what I wanna do is I wanna put in a little bit of our wild mushroom. So we're gonna saute this up and we're gonna add a little bit of seasoning to it. Just a little bit of salt and pepper, okay? With a little bit of ginger soy and fish sauce. We're gonna add a little bit of white wine to it to braise it along with some chicken stock. So the chicken stock will kind of braise that bok choy to make it nice and tender. To finish and complete our swordfish dish, we're gonna place it here, like so. We're gonna put some of the wild mushrooms and juices right here in this bowl. And then we're gonna place the swordfish right here on top, like this. Then I'm gonna take some fresh cilantro and put some fresh cilantro on top. So now, this is our grilled swordfish on braised bok choy and wild mushrooms. Mm -hmm.